So um, I'm here with Anne this afternoon, and we just spent some time doing the ice method. And uh, you work as a doctor at the Brewster, and part of the reason that I wanted to work with you is you said you have just seen a lot of trauma, been exposed to that in these last couple of weeks since the fire started. Exactly. Yeah, yeah a lot of loss, confusion, anger, just a lot of the emotions you see when there's a natural disaster like this. Yeah, and so a lot of what I wanted to do was just share with you what I'm doing. But we ended up um, using it for things that you had your own strong emotions about and have been dealing with for a while. And um, what was your experience with that? Well, really what it was able to, when we first started talking, uh, it was very emotional and the feelings came right to the surface uh, as tears. And I didn't want to talk about it because I was too right, You really upset. weren't even going to talk about it? No, right. because I didn't want to, I don't like to be that upset. But what I really liked was you said, well, you don't have to talk about it, let's just stop, here's a strong emotion, what is that emotion, and then you took it from there. Right, because you already know exactly what the issue is, mm -hmm. and we actually don't want to even do any more with that, we just want to replace that, the chemistry of it. I mean, part of what was fun today was that you're a doctor and we got to talk about chemistry stuff, um, but that's actually not the important thing of the conversation. It was literally that you were able to replace stored emotions, some of them even from many, many years or even decades, and now you feel calm about them. That's right. Yes. Yeah. I went from a place of feeling very sad to accepting that this is okay where I'm at right now. Okay. So is this, I mean, as I told you, part of what I'd like to do really is to be as helpful as possible to people after the trauma of this Carlton Complex fire and just your thoughts on how it might be beneficial to people? I think this would really be invaluable to people to just help them uh, be able to reset the emotion mm -hmm. and so that they can more appropriately deal with the situation they have to deal with rather than from a position of anger or fear, they can approach it more calmly and rationally. Well, Anne, it was a pleasure spending time with you today. Thanks thank for what you. you're doing at Brewster. And, um, and thank you very much. Thank you. All right.